So um, this past um, week, uh, last week during all of that uh, weather that we had, um, something really important happened. Um, our parks director, um, Luann Maisner, uh, who's been with us um, since October of 99, so she's in her 20th year uh, with the township, and as you know, does a fantastic job for us, was recognized by the State Association, um, the Parks Association for the Fellowship Award, which is a coveted award um, that is presented to the best and brightest in the state of Michigan. And we're very pleased that uh, uh, Director Maisner received that this year. And I would like to just take, if I could have um, Luanne come up, and I would like to, if it's okay, although I'm not, probably technology available to do this, but I would like if Mr. Gibas. Well, Mr. Gibas is right yeah, behind you, so you're can, all uh, set. If we can, we can run, run through this. I would like you to see the presentation uh, that was made to Director Maisner at the state conference in Kalamazoo uh, last week. Thank you. First up is Luann Maisner. For more than 30 years, Luann Maisner has demonstrated a high level of professionalism and integrity no matter where she was. Luann is a committed, forward-thinking director who is always ahead of the curve. Her innovative and broad-based programming is something she shares with our profession for the betterment of us all. thanking Greg Rokehouse and Mike Devlin for nominating me for this award. I'd also like to thank some people that are here today with me. Um, our park commissioners, Mike McDonald, Mark Stevens, and Courtney Wazinski. Courtney was a park commissioner and now she moved up to be a township board member. Um, I have many of my staff members here as well. Um, Mike Devlin, I gotta put my glasses on. <laughs> <laughs> Um, Mike Devlin, Darcy, Jane, Kelsey, Corey, and Brittany. Um, I also have my husband here, my daughter, Christine, and the giant surprise for me was my daughter, Jennifer, who lives in Florida, showed up in my hotel room tonight. Wow. So I'm so happy that Jennifer is here with me. I also have three very special counterparts who are here. Mary Shire, who has retired and actually came back to be here tonight for me. Brett Kaczynski and Tim McCaffrey. Also very happy that my very good friend, Ken Hayward is here. Thank you all for being here, it does mean a lot. When I started college back in the fall of 1978, like most high school grads, I was not, I was not clear on the career path I was interested in pursuing. But I can tell you today, that I could not have picked a better major or a better career, as my life in the last 37 years has been nothing but personally rewarding and fulfilling, and I feel very blessed. Following college, I worked as a teaching tennis pro and manager at an indoor tennis facility, and happily a few years later, my dream job opened, recreation and marina supervisor for the city of Muskegon. This was the job I knew I was born for. Um, I had participated in parks and recreation programs there at the city my entire life, and this was my chance to continue the tradition. The director at the time was Rick Scott. Rick was the best mentor anyone could ask for. I owe much of my success in this field to him, as he was a true leader and teacher. I also need to recognize Park Supervisor Bernadette Young. She moved from being the Recreation Supervisor to the Park Supervisor, and together we were a handful for Rick <coughs> and a great team. Five years later, I met Mike, and we were married, and I moved to the Lansing area and began a job with the City of DeWitt as their first Director of Parks and Recreation. This was the perfect next job for me as I was able to gain valuable administrative experience. I took a pay cut to work for the city of DeWitt, but it really paid off as it led me to the most fulfilling job of my career, serving as the first director of Parks and Recreation for Meridian Township. Being first does have its advantages. You can hire your own staff, 
create your own direction, build your own department. The last 19 and a half years have been amazingly rewarding, not based on accomplishments, as much as being able to work with the team of professionals in my department and watching them totally rock their jobs. And I am so very proud of them, even though they make crazy videos. <laughs> <laughs> Our elected park commissioners um, are an amazing group of leaders who are smart, supportive, and are really on top of the issues important to our field as well as important to our community. And I have really surrounded myself with the best. I have been fortunate to have good mentors and teachers in my life, my parents, my bosses, and coworkers. And I have learned something from each and every one of them. I can remember my father telling me, be sure to protect your reputation as it takes a lifetime to build and only moments to destroy. And I have always tried to live by that advice. And I can remember my mother telling me, if you are doing something that you cannot tell me about, then you should probably not be doing it. <laughs> I can't say I always followed that advice, <laughs> but I did for the most part. But together, my parents provided me with great moral compass to follow. In closing, again, I'd like to thank Mike and Greg for nominating me, the awards committee for selecting me, the M. Parks family for your friendship, guidance, and support throughout my career, my staff, the park commission, our township manager, Frank Walsh, and the entire Meridian management team. But most of all, I'd like to thank my husband, Mike, and daughters, Jennifer and Christine. Mike Maisner worked for this organization and led this organization for a number of years, and he set a strong example of professionalism for all of us. As we know, when you're in Parks and Recreation, your entire family is in Parks and Recreation. <laughs> Volunteer recruitment begins at home. <laughs> so thank you to my family for your generosity and volunteer support over the years. Receiving this award is amazing, and please know how meaningful this is to me. I used to think that working hard to do good things in my community was reward enough. But this award tonight has really capped it off for me. Thank you very much. Uh, when, I, when I returned, oh, is it on? Not yet. Now it is. When I returned from conference um, and I brought the video, it was like 15 minutes long. It's been, believe it or not, it's been reduced. Um, uh, but anyway, I wanted to make sure that Frank could see this because along with this, there was a video that was put together by my staff and various members of the community. And um, it was just a very meaningful time for me. And this is the most, um, the highest reward or award that our state association does bestow upon a professional. And um, working here for Meridian Township really has been uh, the best part of my entire career, and I thank you for that. Well, we thank you very much for being here, for doing everything that you do. Thank you. Thank Board you, members, Supervisor. Anybody? Appreciate it. Yeah, I think, think we said it.